Can I have 10 munchkins, please? If only cocaine was that cheap. What are you doing? Okay, now look. I, I'm, I'm, let's be serious. I don't actually do cocaine. I mean, this is a lot like crack, I mean. Mm. Do I have dust on my nose? I bet it's dust. This series is gonna talk about something very important. I think you all can relate. It's gonna be about sugar. But we're segueing, right? I like sugar. Sugars in donuts. And donuts give me dopamine, a chemical reaction in the body. Now, if everybody likes dopamine, you know, the feel-good hormone in your body, everyone could say they're addicted to dope, right? Therefore, everyone's an addict. You are a dope addict. I am a dope addict. Everyone's a dope addict of some kind. Let's talk a little bit more about that. Oh, these are our common suspects. I mean, crim students. I mean, the four horsemen of the apocalypse. Ruby on rails, I mean, on the couch. Some of you might know that one. The salad bar. The greenhouse effect. Lima beans. And my favorite, the white rock. We're gonna get into the four horsemen of the apocalypse another day, but today, I talk about my drug, my addiction to dope. I mean, to sugar. So, let's get into the white rock. You see that? See that little face? Does that look like a crackhead to you? I was not born this way, okay? This chump done made me this way. Look at that. The white rock in its pure form. Welcome to Dopamine High School. Population, your face. Anyway, um, what is all this? I don't know what all this is. You see this guy? He was innocent, young, naive. This young man was addicted to chocolate glazed donuts. And I know what you're thinking. He kind of looks like a chocolate glazed donut. Kind of makes you This guy only would eat donuts. My mom would ask, what is, what's for lunch, Jordan? And I'm like, donuts. What's for breakfast? Donuts. What's for dinner? Donuts. If it didn't have powdered sugar on it, it was not an option. This is when it all started, folks. My addiction started at a young time, and maybe, maybe yours did too. Teach a child the way he should go, and he will not stray from it. But, teach, but teaching a man, how does the Bible verse go again? It's a lot more difficult to teach a man. And since I'm a man now, uh, I have grown to be completely addicted to this white rock you see here. Now, let me tell you something, folks. You cannot balance sugar with sweat. If you exercise only to eat, you will end up losing this game. I'm telling you, it doesn't work. Let's get to these sugar facts. Did you know that sugar is designed for you to have massive cravings and yet low satisfaction? It, um, it causes spikes in dopamine levels. And we humans are designed to crave high calorie foods. So these donuts, it's, na it, it's an abomination. Mm. Um, what was I talking about? So some solutions you guys can have. Solutions include eating fruits, you know, that forbidden, not the forbidden fruit, no, no, that's a completely different thing. Fruits, fruits are high in fiber and fiber helps you with sugar. And it's natural sugar, not the same. Also eating natural food, as in foods without like ingredient labels, organic food. If I slab a sticker on ice cream that says organic, that doesn't mean it's organic. That's a bad excuse to eat donuts. What else did I want to say? So, ladies and gentlemen of the class. 
Mm. It should be illegal. Mm. What's your drug? I should have got less powdered donuts because powdered donuts are actually disgusting. I'm all about glazed cake donuts. Cocaine is one hell of a drug. Mm, it sure is. I mean, not, not that I... You know, sugar is like eight times as addictive as cocaine. So when I say these are like cocaine, I mean that in the worst possible way. Like the worst possible way. I mean, there's no good way to say it.